Welcome back. Two exotic birds escaped from the Honolulu Zoo after a tree branch crashed onto their enclosure. Howard Dashevsky and photographer Rob DeMello pick up the story at Kapi'olani Park, where one of the birds was spotted late this afternoon. People who came to witness one of the giant downed trees wound up being treated to something even more spectacular. Shortly before 5 this afternoon, more than a dozen zoo workers, all with large nets in hand, headed for one of the big trees after reports one of the birds was seen there. Although they're called ground hornbills, they do fly, as we discovered during a live update at the top of the 5 o'clock hour. And now it's flying again, so it's been going back and forth across the street, and there it is. Well, nobody's got a better view of it than us right now. Using chicken and mice in hopes of luring the animal down to the ground, the bird kept the zookeepers on the run, flying from one side of the park to another. Back to the big tree. Yep. A family visiting from Bulgaria was enjoying a barbecue when the bird took up temporary residence right above them. Didn't expect to see this today. No, no, for sure, no. Yeah, but it was so exciting. After chasing after the bird for more than an hour and a half, the team of zoo workers finally lost sight of the animal and called it a night with hopes that it may find its own way home. She does have a mate back at the zoo that we do have in holding, so uh, they do have a vocalization that they do, so hopefully she can uh, vocalize to her mate and um, she'll come back to the zoo. If the bird doesn't return home on its own, officials will resume their search tomorrow morning at first light, hopeful that the bird will stay within the Kapilani Park area. Uh, the best thing for people to do is do not feed her, um, do not put out food, call 911 if you see her. Howard Dashevsky, KHON 2 News.